accepting people for who they are, letting them express themselves. There's a huge amount of their well-being and happiness. I mean, the, the happiness and the stuff, it all flows out of that. And you have to be who you are. The thing I love about the Governor's Conference is that it allows LGBTQ students to be celebrated rather than legislated. Uh, in a state that often tells them what they can't or can't be, we tell them that anything is possible and that their dreams are worth living. Spaces that are safe for these kids is really important to show that they are valued, are supported, that they have organizations and, and community supports that they can turn to when the state is kind of letting them down in a lot of different ways and creating hostile environments for them. I think about spaces like this throughout uh, queer history. I think about Stonewall, both before uh, the riots, where it was a place where we celebrated our community, and then after the riots, a place where we circled around and said, this is a place where we stood up and fought. And will it seem strange to call a space like that a safe space? There are spaces where our joy gets centered. Having a space where we can not only turn to ourselves and say, this is who I am and what a joy it is to be me, but to also have a space where we can see that joy reflected back to us in the others that are a part of our community, that is the spot that fuels us as we march towards progress.